Cheers, I'm Habitor Owen on our Extra Math Challenge. And our Extra Math Challenge for today is all about Grade 9 Math Lessons in Quarter 4, Module 2. And it is all about trigonometric functions. Namely, cosecant, which is the um, reciprocal of sine. Second, which is the reciprocal of cosine. And the tangent, which is the reciprocal of tangent. Okay, so we have here an example of a right triangle or a figure of a right, right triangle. So in the first problem, we're asked to find the value of B. So to find the value of B, we're going to use the Pythagorean theorem. C squared is equal to A squared plus B squared. So B squared is equal to C squared minus A squared. Okay? So by substitution, C is equal to 25. Or 25 squared minus the value of A, which is 7. Or 7 squared. Okay? So 25 squared is equal to 6 to 5 minus the square the 7 squared which is 49 so b squared is equal to 60 625 minus 49 is equal to 576 okay so we're going to square root both sides. Okay, so square root of b squared is equal to square root of 576. So b is equal to the square root of 576, which is 24. Okay, so the value of our b is 24. Okay, so now that we have we have solved the value of b just equal to twenty five. Okay. Four. I mean twenty four. Sorry. Okay. Okay. So we will move to the second problem. So in the second problem, we're asked to find the ratio of cosecant A. Okay. So remember that cosecant is the reciprocal of sine. So cosecant A is equal to hypotenuse over opposite. Okay. So, the second A is equal to our hypotenuse, which is 25 over the opposite of our um, reference. reference angle, reference angle A, which is 7. So, the ratio of cosecant A is equal to 25 over 7. Okay. So in the third problem, we are asked to find the ratio of second A, okay? 
So let's remember that second is the reciprocal of cosine. So second A is equal to hypotenuse over adjacent. Okay. So second A is equal to our hypotenuse, which is 25. And the adjacent of the reference angle A, which is 24. So the ratio of second A is equal to 25 over 4. So in the fourth fourth problem, in the fourth problem, we are asked to find the tangent a. Okay. So remember that the reciprocal of cotangent is tangent. So cotangent a is equal to hypotenuse. Oh, I mean. Adjacent, adjacent over opposite. Okay. So, the tangent A is equal to our adjacent. So, the adjacent of our reference angle A is 24 over the opposite of our reference angle A, 7. So the ratio of cotangent A is equal to 24 over 7. So, okay, 24 over 7. So, the next problem, we're going to have B as our reference angle, okay? So, in the fifth problem, we are asked to find cosecant B, okay? So, cosecant B is equal to hypotenuse over opposite okay so second B is equal to our hypotenuse which is 25 and the opposite of our reference angle B which is 24 okay so the ratio of cosecant B is equal to 25 over 4. So 25 over 24. Okay. So in the sixth problem, we are asked to find second B. Okay? So second B is equal to hypotenuse over adjacent. Okay? So second B is equal to our hypotenuse which is 25 and the adjacent of our reference angle B which is 7 so the ratio of second P is equal to 25 over 7 
So in our last problem, we are asked to find the cotangent B. Cotangent B. So cotangent B is equal to adjacent over opposite. Okay. So cotangent B Tangent B is equal to the adjacent of our reference angle B, which is 7. And the opposite of our reference angle B, which is 24. Okay, so the ratio of our cotangent B is equal to 7 over 24. Okay, so that's it for today and I hope you learned something and thank you very much for watching this video and please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much.